the co-founder of Microsoft, which ultimately became the world's largest software company, Bill Gates is now one of the richest men in history. Philanthropic as well as wealthy, known by his family as Trey, Gates grew up in Seattle, Washington, where he was enrolled in a private school, Lakeside, in 1967 at the age of 12. The following year, at a time when few people outside universities, military research and big businesses had access to computers, Lakeside bought computing time from the nearby Computer Center Corporation, CSC. Gates, including his friend Paul Allen, became hooked and learned to write programs in basic computer language. The young programmers soon found bugs and security failings in CSC's system. Eventually, the company offered Gates and the others free computing time if they fixed these bugs and helped to identify any further security weaknesses in their system. Gates and Allen quickly developed a talent for writing useful applications, such as payroll programs and ways to automate Lakeside's class timetable, which also enabled Gates to put himself in lessons with his preferred classmates. Although initially his schooling suffered due to his computer obsession, Gates still earned a place at Harvard University in 1973. However, once there, he rarely attended lectures, spending his time in the computer rooms instead. Developments in computing in the mid-1970s saw home computers go on sale to the public for the first time. Gates and Allen envisaged computers becoming as common as typewriters in offices and televisions in homes. This prediction prompted Gates to drop out of Harvard in 1975 in order to write software for one of the first computers, the Altair 8080. He and Allen formed Microsoft that year. Booming Business Microsoft remained a small business until 1980 when it struck a deal to supply IBM with an operating system for its new personal computer, PC. With no software of its own, Microsoft bought an existing system, QDOS, from Seattle Computer Products, modified it, then sold it to IBM as MS-DOS, while retaining the rights to sell the system elsewhere. As sales of IBM's PCs soared, many companies began manufacturing their own PCs, known as clones. With millions of computers running MS-DOS, and from 1985, Microsoft Windows, business boomed. Successive software releases bolstered Microsoft's status as the industry leader. Today, more than four out of five of the world's desktop PCs and laptops use Microsoft Windows. Paul Allen shared a fascination with computers with Bill Gates and helped to co-found Microsoft. Allen came up with the name Microsoft and was instrumental in negotiating the deal through which the company bought the QDOS operating system. Allen left Microsoft in 1982 due to serious health problems and growing tensions between him and Gates. In his lifetime, Allen donated over $2 billion towards the advancement of the arts, science, technology, and education. 1968 creates Microsoft. Registers company name Microsoft 1976. Sales exceed $1 million in just two years. Becomes youngest ever billionaire at the time, 1987, aged 31, with a net worth of $1.25 billion. Resigns as chairman of Microsoft to concentrate on Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, 2014.